I got this 66 Land Cruiser. I'm going to take it over to Gary at Four Before Works. I'm going to toughen this truck up a little bit. Put a little lift kit on it, a little dress up kit on the motor. It's going to be tight. I know that one time you told me in the past you sold these new back in the 70s. Even though that kind of shows your age, <laughs> yeah, I wouldn't go back that way. It. But let me show you something that I'll bet they didn't do back in the 70s or the 60s that this is. What is this, Tommy? It's got a little V8 Whoa. transplant in it. A Chevrolet V8. You know, when these things first came out in a V6, they were really underpowered. That'd be the reason why someone stuck a V8 motor in it. But the only problem is it lacks a little bit of uh, pizzazz. So what else do you want to do? Well, then stuff? if you stand back and look at it, I, I'm, I'm thinking lift kit, I'm thinking wheels and tires. Here's the bad news I'm gonna drop on you. I need this all done in two or three days. Well, I wouldn't expect any less, Tommy. You want it cheap uh, you and go. you want it fast. We'll get this deal done. All right, Tommy, so you wanted all this stuff in two or three days. Let me tell you, we have had to bend on our vendors to get this stuff in here. This is almost like waking up Christmas time. <laughs> you have a right. lot of toys. The only thing you're missing is a well, tree over here. Well, cool, man. Well, it looks like you guys wrapped this thing in one pile for me here. Let's get this thing put together. we got two days left. You know, in about every vehicle I buy, I'm always thinking outside the box. Like this Land Cruiser, we spent a little bit of money on it, put a lift kit on it, wheels, tires. T take it out of the ordinary, not quite so vanilla. It's always going to end up paying me at the end. You know, powder coating is a much better method than painting. It's a lot more durable, it's stronger, and at the end, it always pays off. So I just talked to Gary. They just finished the Land Cruiser, and I can't wait to see it. When I first saw this Land Cruiser, I thought, wow, now there's what it's supposed to look like, even better than I thought it would. And I had high expectations for it. Lo and behold, Tommy's always right. This is what I call money in the bank.